Three UCLA basketball players will soon be home after they were detained in China for over a week on shoplifting charges. KCAL 9's Jeff Nguyen is live at LAX where they're expected to land in less than a couple of hours. Jeff. And Lena and Juan right behind us right now are some of the news photographers that are waiting for the players' arrival. That's because the board says that their plane is expected to land at around 5 o'clock today. And for the first time, UCLA acknowledged why three of its players were held behind after the rest of the team was able to come home this weekend. This is video from TMZ showing three UCLA basketball players getting ready to board their flight home at the Shanghai airport. LiAngelo Ball, Cody Riley, and Jalen Hill were accused last week of shoplifting during a team trip. Their release comes after President Trump said he asked China's president to help. President Xi has been terrific on that subject, but that was not a good subject. That was not something that should have happened. For the first time, UCLA acknowledged the players were involved with shoplifting charges. In a statement, the chancellor said, I want to be clear that we take seriously any violations of the law. In this particular case, both athletics and the Office of Student Conduct will review this incident and guide any action with respect to the involved students. A long Bruin walk, the players' release has been the talk of campus. Some have made light of the situation, but most students don't find the matter funny. I think they should face some form of punishment for it because obviously it's not excusable, but I just think, thank God they're coming back and they're safe and they're not going to be punished more than they should be. Bruins say the whole thing is upsetting because the three players were star recruits and Ball has the most to lose because he's the younger player of Laker rookie Lonzo Ball and his family is the focus of a reality show. I don't want to get them like kicked off the team because like I want the team to do well, but like maybe uh, like less like game minutes for like until they prove themselves that they're worthy of like playing again. I think that they shouldn't have special privileges just because they're athletes, I would say. They broke they broke the rule. And the players are expected to go through here after they clear customs. The university says that all three players are expected to speak tomorrow morning along with the university's athletic director as well as the head basketball coach. That's the latest from here. We'll send it back to you.